My name is Miriam Imam and my project is um, Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity. And the objects I used was a sphere and it can be opened up and inside the sphere we put rocks and um, we used ropes to keep it together so it wouldn't open up. And we also used uh, a, a small metal um, bar, a ball, and we used um, a bomb with water inside of it. To show the simulation, we used a trampoline. Isaac Newman thought that space was like a rigid surface. And if there is an object in space, like a star, and there was another object, like a planet, it's, it's either going to be caught in orbit, or it's going to be pulled towards it by an invisible force called gravity. In 1915, Albert Einstein discovered that Space is not like a rigid surface, it is like an elastic surface, like a trampoline surface. And if an object gets shot into space, it's going to go in straight in a line. However, if there's an object, in, if there's a heavy object in space, it's going to bend the space like that. This part of my simulation is about gravitational lensing. Just like a lens can bend light, gravity can bend light too. And here is how it works in Einstein's theory. This tape shows a beam of light shooting from point A to point B. Right now, because there is no heavy um, object in space, the beam of light is straight. If there is a heavy object in space, then the beam of light will bend. If a heavy object is put in the middle of space, then the beam of light will bend along with space. Like that. Einstein's theory is that there is no invisible force called gravity. If an object gets close to a heavy massive object like a star, it is going to follow the bending of space. Okay, here is an object that's going to approach the star. Or get caught in its orbit. Because of friction, the object got stuck, got pulled it in, but if there was no friction, then the object would just keep going in orbit.
while it lasted, um, I don't know, it got, it's, 